This moth is dead, but it is a natural curiosity. It just hatched out of one of my cocoons and then immediately died, and I wondered why, if something is wrong with it. But upon closer inspection, something strange is going on here. Look at the antenna. Do you see that? Clearly one antenna is male and one antenna is female. And upon closer inspection, its abdomen, if we examine it, is a female abdomen. And if I squeeze it, I can even feel the eggs in here. This makes it a, a gynandromorph. Interestingly, the, the wings look rather more convincingly male than female. So I am totally surprised at this strange gynandromorph here. It seems it has a female body, but the wings are mostly male. Which is really, really odd. But you can see, also see a size difference in one half uh, compared to the other. It's not very symmetrical, is it? Um, I'm probably going to throw this one on eBay. It will make a collector happy. It could be quite valuable, although it's not a spectacular Ganendromorph. It's still a, quite an odd, a natural curiosity and an oddity. And I just wanted to show you this on YouTube. The moth is uh, still half alive. I think I saw one of the legs move just some seconds ago, but uh, it's uh, it's dying. And that's, that was an indicator that it wasn't healthy. It could be there are internal disturbances or whatever. Um, now, what a gynomorph is and how it works, um, I'm going to explain this to you in a new upcoming video that I'm working on. So for now, you'll have to accept the fact that this is half male, half female. 